So today we are going to create uh, this type of sky age. It will be very useful for your 2D and 3D games where you can easily control the rotation speed of uh, clouds and or sky and uh, you can also make it night to day and day to night or you can change the speed from transition like this. So now start our tutorial. Hello everyone. So today we are going to create the dynamic 2D and 3D sky. So uh, in order to creating the sky, first we need to download this free asset, All Sky Free. So now I'm going to download it. You can also download the other sky package skybox which is also available in the asset store or somewhere else from this So uh, I think this tutorial will help you to create the uh, rotating or dynamic sky and creating the instantly day and night time in, in all your 2D and 3D games and it is very uh, lightweight for your game. Okay, so the asset is imported. Uh, okay, so just open the scene, click blue sunset, and uh, now I will adjust the camera. Okay, so your game, game views will be look like this and now I'm going to create a script first we need to create an empty object add an script to sky controller So now uh, we need to create in Visual Studio. Okay, so first of all, we need to check what parameter we need to change. Okay, so Here uh, I have selected the view sunset and then change the rotation so you can see we need to change the rotation parameter dynamically but uh, I am just going on windows rendering and light setting so here is the material or the skybox uh, which we need to take the reference from there ok so uh, go to the scripting and create a Private material and skybox. You cannot keep the 
render setting so now uh, I will go for the shader editor edit setter so now you can check the name of the rotation parameter it is underscore rotation We can see the set fluid. So to use uh, two type of parameter. First will be a string name of the parameter, and the second will be float. So just pass the name of the parameter rotation, and the second will be value for the rotation. So we just get the value of currently current rotation. So now we can check whether our uh, script is working or not. So when we increase the speed from 0 to 1 or 2, so uh, our sky will start rotating. Yeah, and you can also increase the speed as much as you want from 0 to 1000 or Maybe 10 or 1, 2, whatever you want to do. Okay, so now I am going to create the switching time function. Speed of public pool is 9. Okay, so now we need to change the this color. Okay, so we go to uh, edit setter and check the name of the color it is underscore tint we also create a new private float here t factor t factor is stand for time factor Create one more uh, float for night value. Which is RGBA. Okay, so R, R, G, and B, and A for alpha, alpha should be one every time. Okay, and then we create the number.
just copy these two lines paste it here and this size will be plus because now we if we want to increase the die factor or the factor okay so okay now i think it should be work okay so we need to get it on my time point one okay so when we want to night and day and increase the speed to one Okay, so here you can see our sky is rotating and we can easily switch between day and night. Okay, so if you want to uh, change the speed of getting night to day and day to night, so you can also create a float. Change the speed and Just multiply it with time dot take time. Now we can also uh, control the speed of Okay, so now check what we have done. Okay, and when I reduce the speed, so it will take uh, much time to be day to night and night to day. And also make it faster by increasing the value. Okay, so hope you like this tutorial. Please subscribe to my channel and uh, I will post the latest tutorial like this and very easy tutorial for beginners so that you can learn more UT and make more games. Thank you. Thank you so much. And please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and also join the UT tutorial group on Facebook. Link will be in description. Okay, thank you guys. Bye bye.